Okay, what's up guys? DJX and welcome to episode two for Battle Factory Season Two. Hope you guys are doing alright. Enjoying your week. Or at least the week that you had. Alright, it looks like Pretty decent team on both sides. I'm going to go for the fake out. And I think double edge should do a decent amount. Like you got a critical hit. It's not bad. Alright, Feral Seed will come out. And looks like I don't really have a direct counter. Except for this tangle up. I don't want to make hidden power fire obvious. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to switch into tangle up basically. And now that he probably knows why I'm out. So now I just switch into hot turn. Alright, there we go. Lured out the bonus thing. There we go. All right, two to six. We're doing good so far. Here comes the Miss Matrix. It does outspeed us. So I'm kind of scared about that. I actually do want to keep. I want to keep harder. Yeah. So it's bring Scyther out. And it's going to go for a Shadow Ball. It's going to do 51%. That's a decent amount. So now I'm going to go for Knockoff. And hopefully do some decent amount of damage. He has a Cobra Berry. Okay, it's not bad. It's not bad. Kind of, kind of want to go for superpower because I mean, I can still use Miss Mages for Haunter. I'll think of some. So let's go for Aqua Jet's weapons. And I had a feeling. I had a feeling. But the good thing is now we can just sleep powder. Who's gonna stay in actually? Alright, 51%. Man, not too shabby. Switching to Polyrath, no problem. Now we sleep powder. Oh, the ice beam probably will knock us out. I don't know why people don't run the physical set anymore. I mean, just look. That's not bad. 95 compared to 70. Anyways, let's just go for Hidden Power or Giga Drain. Now, I think the Hidden Power Ground should knock. Or it's in range of almost defeating it. It's going to knock off our Black Sludge. And. We kind of got the paralyzation at least from the effects, but all right, protect. Nothing wrong with that. Just go for another power ground, and we should have the game. Vileplume's also a good Pokemon. You don't need a chlorophyll. Vileplume's just good. It's a decent bulk. Pretty, not that bad. Whoa, that was perfect. Okay, okay. Probably, I want to say it would be odd if it was scarfed, but I don't think it would be. So I'm gonna take a gamble. I'm gonna go for double edge. Uh, print flip, okay. Haunter is going to come out. Well, no, I'm actually, I'm actually gonna. Uh, Alright, good. So I'll just bring Baskin back out and just fodder it off. Try to fire off some decent damage. So now we just go for superpower. 23%. Not bad. Not bad at all. Yeah. Okay, okay. Now we go for Slip. And. If he decides to switch no. Alright, we got a problem here. 
got a bit of a problem. Actually, did I expect Hunter would faint? Uh, let's see, we got two more Apollo and MS Mages. They're both under under half. That's good. Destiny Bond. Okay. So now it kind of forces us to go for an attack, I guess. I'm going to... And I think... Yeah, so I guess we kind of lost this one just because... Well, we tried. That was actually a really close battle, too, actually. It wasn't bad. Anyways, hope you guys have a good Friday. Just had to check outside real quick. Overall, hope you guys are having a really good Friday. Mine's it was alright. Classes were good. But yeah, I think we kinda played Kangas got better, we kinda won. Now we have Alright. Oh, we have I don't want this hit on Chan. Alright, alright. Flygon's really gonna be a yeah. So I think we just switch HP Ghost. DJ Marcy, we're going to go to the street. Well, um, next time I'm recording, so next time you don't do that. So go ahead, guys. I'm recording. Are you guys just? Yeah, I'm going to see. Yeah. Going in the bathroom. Do not disturb. Okay. Now that we are back. And my dog is being stupid. Alright, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch right into... I'm going to go for... Lash Cannon. Because I don't think it's going to happen... All right, fifty-eight percent. Not bad. Not bad at all. Did we outspeed? When? Oh, I don't know. All right, now it's time to bring Hound him out, and I think we could put. Yep, we could sweep once we get it out. All right. All right, so we win now. Hopefully, as long as we can outspeed the Flygon, and that's gonna be a problem. Cause now we're in range of sucker punch. So now I, get, I have no choice but to switch. Yeah, if we bring a hard score, it's pretty obvious. No, it's gonna bring fortress. Okay, so now I go for dark pulse and sturdy. Not bad. Dynamic punch. Good job, my champ. Good job. All right, four to four. All right, so do we outspeed mode? So now I just hope Brave Bird will do a deep critical hit. That was needed. I think Hoop was our last bet. Now I want to save it for later. All right, this is what I fear. So, do we go for Brave Bird or do we go for Taunt? Uh, let's go for Taunt. Yeah, let's do that. Um, it's a little stupid. Thirty-five percent. That is not bad at all. Could have done more. Be honest, could have done more. I think if we want to win, let me try to encore it into something. I'm kind of stuck here. Uh, still sticky web, even. 
Yeah, alright, we'll go for Sticky Web now. That'll bring Bronzong out. I need to get... I need to get Hoopa in safely without getting damaged. So unfortunately, alright. I was gonna go for a nasty plot, but I can't risk being taken out. Alright, he's gonna bring in his own hoop, and that is gonna go down to a, a shadow ball. Flag on the fortune speeds us roost, not bad. Are gonna go down to toxic next turn. Alright. Here comes uh, Who will win? Looks like they probably will. Yes, most likely they probably win. I don't want to waste any of your guys' time. But the game, or the wall, the game. Not that bad. Alright. Let's look for another one. It's doing so, doing so good so far. Yes, Marowak. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Pretty decent team. Not gonna lie. The Tangle again. Alright, Cryogonal. Alright, that's a bad lead. That's a pretty bad lead. So who has the most special defense in my team? Besides Cryogonal. Or fits or defense, do I meant to say? Tangela? No. I really don't have a switch. Someone has to faint. I don't even have Thunder Wave. All right, now we bring Duosion in, and hopefully we can get up some Calm Minds and just start firing off those side shots. Okay, now we just go for recovery. I'm going to try to... Knockout does a good amount. The thing is, if it gets a critical hit, we pretty much run into a chance. Well, we have a chance, but it's trying to set up here right now. Let me see if. Alright, it's equal amount, equal amount. Okay, acid armor. Good. So now we just call mine up. And fire off a side shot. That should go down. Uh, I need to go for a cover now. It's like a crazy amount. Okay. I'm gonna risk it. Let's go for a cover again. Alright, so now the next thing we're going to do is. Let's bring the fairy actually. My plan is to basically, yeah, moon boss anything that comes in. Even, well, no, actually, what I want to do is hopefully I can bring in Marowak on the switch. But uh, me to switch it, me switching to Rapidash so you can clear out you no know, Will O Wisp man. So, uh, oh, is that just going to stay in? Okay. So, the bone ring, or not, let's go for knock and let's see what this is. Perfect. Alright, it's five on five now. I am afraid of Willow Wisp, but I know that it should still go down to a bone ring. It's going to miss. Perfect. Alright. So, Wiki Wiki is going to come out now. I'm going to go to Tangela and try to get a sleep powder off. And then. I think I could bring Cryogonal. Don't know. Probably not. But we are going to miss the sleep powder on the right you, but that's a, that's a big problem. 72%. Okay. Marowak, go in there. Alright, so now we just bump more anything that comes in. If I switch, it's fine. Just going to bring in the Lucky Lucky once again. Bump more to 
Jeez, so I'm just gonna forfeit. Okay, you try. I mean, he couldn't have won. Still, I mean, he had a fracture left over. I don't think Bummer will probably Bummer probably would, but um, yeah. Now we're making a comeback. Hopefully, I like to think. I haven't done a long battle factor episode in a while, so that's what I wanted to do. I only did one battle last week because just on the time. Also, I didn't mention this on Twitter. I forgot to tweet it, so I apologize for that. But I did not. Uh, this it wasn't going to be a to the top of our monotype or. Fit Gen overused because laptop's been acting up recently, so unfortunately, I can't do that. But I can probably bring Floor Sky by the end of the day, and I can also bring in also bring in this. Yeah, you guys are gonna see this. <laughs> All right, Zygarde Magnezon. All right, um. What to do, what to do. I don't have any direct counter to slow bro. That's gonna be a problem. Basically, I'm just gonna dragon dance. Flash can is gonna do it. not that bad of an amount. So now you should just go for earthquake. So this is in the slow bro. We get fire off 73%. I'm gonna test it. Let's see how much extreme speed we do. I'm gonna test it. Let's go switch into Star Raptor. 67%. Alright. Good job, Zygarde. Good job. Slow Bros. Oh, Regenerator. Ah, alright. I see. I see. I think he's gonna switch back out. And Star Raptor is gonna go down to a critical hit. I don't think that was necessary. I think he can bring in Dragonite and yeah, revenge kill me. Or I could go into Cliff King set up reflect. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. Or I could burn it with you. Yeah. Let's bring in Clef Key. Alright, he's actually gonna start setting up Dragon Dance. That's gonna be a problem. So I'm gonna go for the reflect, the fire punch. 47% Excadrill is going to come out and I'll do this five off as I guard. I want to use it later. Oh, we might out. No, we're not going to survive. We're going to have speed. We might not survive. It's going to go for the Toxic. I really can't Earthquake or Extreme Speed or I can go for Outrage. Let's just. Alright, Slowbro is going to go down, but we're also going to go down due to Toxic Poison. So now I'm going to bring Star Raptor out. If Dragonite, if he brings out Dragonite, I'm just going to go for a Brave Bird or a Double Edge. And should either Exodrill or Magnezone come out, then uh, I guess I just start bringing Klefki back out. Cause I think Light Screen's going to wear off soon. No, I got five hands. Alright. Let's go for a U turn actually. I don't want to use Star Raptor just yet. I think right now, Star Raptor is my offensive guard. Is my offensive guard jump check. Alright. We're going to set up a calm mind. Magnezone is going to come out. So, what do I do? Do I risk? Well, Clef Kids is going to take a Thunderbolt from Magnezone. But Man was one definitely will. And he predicted a switch. Alright. Nothing wrong with that. Good play. Good play. So now we bring in. We use the light screen. And is it is it Magnet Trip? Magnet Pool? Yeah. Good. Alright. And now we can set up another light screen. He wants to go for Earthquake. He can go ahead. I think I can bring in. Slow bro, once again. 
swords dance. And it's not. So now we just burn it, I guess. And defog the rocks off of the field. I'm not going to use roost because I need to bring in. I need to go for a little look again. Magnezone is going to come out. I right, pretty much can't switch into neither. So I guess I got to stay in. Thunderbolt at 18%. Choice scarf. Okay. Now we, I'll just go for defog. And I can't say I cannot bring in any of my other two Pokemon because we are weak too. So I'm going to roost and a softball would actually excuse me. And not going for the 23% with the, he's going to Volt Switch. He, ha he has three physical Pokemon he can use. Excadrill, all right, thank you. So now I can hopefully land a Will-O-Wisp on the, come on. Are you serious? <laughs> uh, All right, let's see. Slowbo's obviously not going to take this, but if we can burn it, then we might have a slim chance of winning. Uh, oh well. We tried. All right, so now we just click double edge. Oh, we don't. <laughs> Good game. I think this is going to do one more battle. And I'll call it for this episode. You know, kind of had to miss plays. Especially when you predicted the switch. I wanted to stay in, but then I didn't. Because, like, I mean, I shouldn't have known Man was Swine couldn't have came out. But oh well. All right. Last but not least. So, it's probably going to take a while. I'm not good and rarely used. It's my enemy. But we just faced him, too. You look. You look. Yeah, we just faced him. All right. I'm going to go for a sound point. Oh, Scrappy. Okay, that's nice. Does he have any defog or rapid spinner? Nope. Perfect. Okay, that wasn't really fair. I'm gonna find another one. All right, here we go. Now that's the last one. I don't care if you forfeits or not. Missed. Okay, first of all, why do we have we're in partners with Surf? We're only 194, not even. That's something. Anyways, let's start off with. Let's just start off with this stupid thing anyways. I mean, I love Rampart as a Pokemon, but Surf is just unnecessary. Especially on a Pokemon like this, even if it had Shield Force or not. So now we go for Head Smash, since Rampart has the highest attack of all non-legendary and non-Mega Evolved Pokemon. Head Smash is going to do a lot. I want to bring in our own Simicea, but I don't know how well... I don't think we're going to be able to land any attacks. Alright, so now I'm going to go for an Aerial Lace that should get the KO on the Simis here. No, just Salad Berry. Not bad. So we're just, we're just going to be just off by a little bit. It's going to miss the Fire Blast, thankfully, and now it's tied 5-5 five five again. Electrode is going to come out. I'm going to bring in Clang and hope we'll see what we can do. Thunderbolt is going to do a pretty decent amount. I'm going to shift gear. I'm going to shift gear. So I'm going to shift my gears and 
Could it rest? Yeah, I think that's the right thing to do, rest. Wow, we... It's just amazing how much speed Electrode has. Actually, I think it has speed as a whole overused here. It's kind of frowned upon, though. Because it doesn't really have a wide move pool. My thing is only got Shadow Ball. I mean, it's based off a of ball, so why not? Yeah, that's just probably just me. Alright, Gear Grind. Our next Sleep Talk move will be... Shift Gear. And it's going to go down to its own life form. So we do wake up the next turn. I like how all of our stats are over 300 except for our special attack. That's really nice. So now we go for Gear Grind. Should get it down to at least... Nearly just missing 50%. Oh no, 27%. It's not bad. Okay, good. I'm going to fire off a U turn. Let's go right for that U turn. Bring in Mariana. And hopefully, we have a. We'll probably win from here. It looks like we're adamant. We're not jolly. Nothing's wrong with that, but. I think we would probably would have had a chance. So anyways, let's go for the play rough. We are gonna get the KO. Good job. Alright, now we can just knock off the sucker punch. Or oh, crunch, actually. He is going to paralyze us. Now I kind of feel wish. If this float though has bulk up, I know it probably won't. That's gonna be a problem. Alright, so now I just go for sucker punch. Pretty good probably will switch your room. Or oh, hydro pump, okay. Now I'm gonna go for an avalanche. So I can activate our sturdy. Alright. 43%. Not bad. That's X is it. Right there. Good game, bro. Good game. All right. Well, that was it for this week's episode. If you like what you see, you leave a like. If you don't, I don't care. But you can at least do me a favor and subscribe and check out other Battle Factory episodes on my channel. So, yeah. Thank you for watching. I will see you in my next video. Goodbye.